In this video, I'm going to show you how you can take a Google Form, take the information that you collect, and import it into a Google Calendar. Great tool if you're scheduling multiple appointments. So, I already have the form built, and it's called Appointment. And I'm going to show you what you need and what you don't need. So, what Google needs to be able to read, and, and keep in mind, all of this is going to go into a Google Sheet that we're going to download into what's called a CSV. But Google needs certain things that um, are just basically to be able to build the calendar. So here are subject. This Google understands that the start date, start time, end date, end time. You can also denote whether it's an all-day event, description of the event, the location of the event, and private. Notice I did not mark those required because really you don't really need that unless there's something about that you need. So I'm going to go ahead and fill in a couple of these and just show so you can see what it's going to look like. I'm going to go to the preview and I'm going to put in appointment with Michelle. I'm going to give it a start date and time. Let's just pick the 30th and we'll just say 12 noon. To the end date will be same day, and we're going to put 12:30. So a little 30 minute appointment. We're not going to worry about these, and we're going to hit submit. I'm going to go back, submit another response. Just one more. Start date again, and let's just say 11 a.m. Oops, excuse me. Do this and the end date 11:45. Oops, excuse me. Submit. Like I said, you can fill these in, not necessary. Okay, so now we're going to go to our appointment. And notice I have four responses. I'd already filled those in. We're going to go to this sheet. So, subject, start date, start time, end date, end time. I'm going to go here. I'm going to download as, and I'm going to just download as a comrade separated values, which is a spreadsheet. And now I'm going to go to my handy dandy Google Calendar. And down here, and notice I already have two of these because I've already done this once, but I'm going to go ahead and do it again. Let's just go here. And we're going to import a calendar. So I'm going to choose my file, and the file is going to be the one I just downloaded which was the sample form response to CSV. I'm going to open that. And I'm going to upload it. Just so you can see it, I'm just going to put it on my calendar, the Amy Dawson calendar, and I'm going to import that. Four events have come in. And now you'll notice I have four new events on my calendar. If you are an administrator and you need a quick way to put all your staff into for some time slots. If you are a teacher and you're trying to schedule parents, this is another good way. So use your Google form to create that spreadsheet that can be uploaded right into a calendar. It's easy peasy and it makes you a model of efficiency.